ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we're against, oh boy, <laughs> Maelstrom Wanderer. And we're with Marike, everyone's favorite lovely lady. What is she sitting on? Does anyone know what that is? This is rocks. I'm going to discard this hand. This hand is kind of sketchy, but we're going to keep it. So there you go. So Maelstrom Wanderer. I'm all getting to five, so I might not be completely dead. But I don't really feel confident against it. The card is really unfair, as I've always said. And there you have it. But he's at five. I'm at six. I'm on the play, so I'm already ahead. I have a Mana Crypt, though it doesn't really do me any good. Because all my cards cost double blue. Alright, we'll tap land. For him. So, hopefully he doesn't have Rainbow Girl Cultivate big thing that kills me. Well, who knows? Hopefully this mana crypt doesn't kill me. Okay, so I've been pretty busy lately. I've been doing all my pharmacy rotation hours because I'm in pharmacy school. Mind twist. Ooh, -hoo, mind twist. Do we just mind twist him for three? Do we do it? Do we do it? I think we do. I mean, he's not the best, but still. He kept his hand for a reason. And I don't know if we're going to draw land next turn. Mind twist. <laughs> Get there. Court of Calling, Island, Stolen Identity. Alright. Well, there you go. Probably. S this card was not that scary. Oh, come on. Really? Do I post this game? I don't know. I'll think about it. Anyways, if you enjoyed the game, I'm going to post one. I'm going to pause and just make a new one. Be right back. Alright, we're back against a new opponent. You got to get a double feature here. Oh, uh, we will not mull again. We have a pretty good hand. Crucible, we're gonna do some work. Oh my god, we have all these lands. I'll we'll play the Dark Slick Shores first. Because that's gonna come into play tapped if we don't, and we can only just. I mean, sack these lands later. I don't think there's anything in turn one. Of <laughs> Another land, huh? Alright, well. Doesn't really matter what we pick. Alright, so, what's everyone up to? I'm pharmacy school, doing free hours for the pharmacy. Oh, okay, well, that's not the best card for him to have played. I've just been so busy. Um, you guys didn't like my last game I posted, because you said it was not the most exciting game, but it was literally the first game of the night. Just like this is the first game, well, second game now, because I combined two into one. Let's get a Hollow Fountain. That's the nature of the game. People just leave the game, people... Oh wow, that's the worst driver, isn't it? I would say so. Alright, well... Let's Crucible here. Past turn, next turn we can... Play Solemn. Get more land out of our deck. Oh, we can play Teza here? Because he's not interested in that. Maybe he's afraid of me taking it. Anyway... We're just gonna start wind swept heathing things up. Let's get a tundra. Play solemn for mana efficiency reasons. And get something good. What are we gonna get? An island. Deck's mostly blue heavy. Let's just get an island. Pass the turn. Now we have six mana next turn. Pretty sweet. Okay. What does this card do? Oh, each player draws a card? Why would you play that card? I guess white, black. Well, black can draw cards, so. I'm not really sure why he's playing it, but he's playing it. We'll attack him. I don't mind if he trades here. I'll get a card out of it. not blocking. Alright. Blue, black, white, Enrique. Oh, he's gonna get alive because of black. That's awesome. There's not really a reason to play land tax. I could always get rid of it later. Um, I'm not gonna do that. So, what could happen here? I don't know. I'm gonna draw something that's not land, though. Not land and not land tax. After I have Crucible and 
Crucible and fetch lands here. Talisman's pretty sweet. Getting that life. I like this card. I wouldn't play this card. I think it's... One life is usually irrelevant unless you have, like, a Drox Glory for other life gain effects that matter. Maybe he does. You could have those, like, win the game if you have so many life cards. I've seen white-black decks that play those cards, the ones where if you have X amount of life, you win the game. Blood Seeker, okay. So you could be a life gain deck. Uh, I'm not quite sure, but we'll see. You could be playing that Viscopa Guild Mage where you've, like, you can infinite combo people with that and uh, Exquisite Blood. But I'm not quite sure. Let's get a Godless Shrine. Get this Godless Shrine out of our deck. Godless Shrine has sweet art. I really like this art a lot. I just really like what they did with the colors on the stained glass. I like this one a lot. It's one of the few um, turn or the new Ravnica lands I like better than the original. <laughs> I just draw land again, really. Oh my god! It's like it makes me want to just like temporal mastery because I have nothing else better to do. Probably should just not attack because it holds back its whole team. Oh my god. I guess we just play this um, land tag and it doesn't do anything. It really does nothing. Oh, we're dead. Just run across a card. Yeah. I'll discard a land. What do you know? <laughs> Thanks for the land. Oh, I would have liked to spend that last turn too. Alright, well, we need to do something that's important. Homeward Path? No! <laughs> the best land against us. How does this draw an actually homeward path like out of nowhere? Well, that's really unfair. This is why you need to play strip mine in your deck. Because this card exists against me. <laughs> okay, well hopefully I do not draw a land for like the fifth time in a row. Just drawing land continuously is not a way to win the game. Come on, game. Okay, we'll get a scrub land, why not? Maybe well, doesn't just like Yeah, that is totally a land. Alright, well I think we're gonna have Temple Master here and cycle it. Because we're not having anything going on. Opponent is holding back things, he might have a wrath on his hand. And just really need to get on with this game here. This land tax is pointless. I don't know what he's going to do here. Get one more land out of our deck. We're only five cards deeper. Like all these planes. Get out of here, planes. What's your favorite card? Planes. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Uh, we could also remove a suspend counter from our card, which is. Ooh, T Tamio. So we could Homeward Path. Tamio is Homeward Path. It's not the worst thing ever. Just put a point on. Alright, so. Hmm, what's the point? I'll probably just play Tamio. One, two, three, four, five. Tamio. Yeah, we're probably just going to tap his Homeward Path. We can tap his black mana. I'm not really all too concerned about his black mana, but this Homeward Path stops him from doing things. And now you can Miki Koro and draw his cards, and I'm pretty happy with that, so. Pretty, feeling pretty good here. I mean, you could play as Teza and then sack three white creatures. Not quite yet. Maybe he'll draw a card. Yes. Alright, that's good. We have a ton of mana. We're not missing a land drop this game, so... Let's see what happens. It doesn't, like, Oblivion zone us and make me really sad. Soul Warden, okay. What does he do here? I actually don't want to draw this. It's like, no, it's, it's mana. Where's that Basilica? Okay. Interesting. What's he gonna do? I have to find a way to win this game. Currently, don't have one yet. 
Hmm. What's that card do? Okay. Well, it's pretty good against Phantasm Image. It's pretty good against Marie King. Hmm. The card's a bad card to steal. It's also a bad card for me because I have to pay two life now. I think what should I do? Um, whatever. Just let it go. Oh, cryptic command. Not the absolute worst. It's pretty bad. I mean, no, it's, cryptic is really good. Okay, so he has a bunch of creatures. Let's do this, this signet. Let's tap his white black mana. Because it's like, you know, it's two mana versus one. He returned his, um, yeah, he definitely returned his thing, so. Can we need a dressing relevant? Cryptic Command's pretty good, though. I don't see what happens. <clears throat> He's gonna play his uh, Homeward Path now. <coughs> this card's gonna be a little annoying. Never seen this card. Actually, this is the first time I've ever seen this card. It's like staying on a giant squid. Doesn't that look like a giant squid like laying in the middle of the field? That eye. So it's not very good though. You don't want to give your opponent an option to not be tapped. Like you probably just play like that uh anything that just taps the creature. Oh well. He's playing white black, so that's one of his options. And he's playing Soul Warden. So he might be some kind of a life gain deck. I'm not quite sure. Soul Warden. Talisman. Um, this Demon's Horn. Are all life gain -y spells, obviously. And this is like an anti life gain spell for your opponent. Ball Coffers, huh? I'm not sure what that's about. Maybe some like random Cabal Coffers and no swamps. Maybe he has Urborg. That's totally possible. So if he's gonna attack in, he's gonna kill me with this card, making me pay two life and they keep him again tap. Okay, he's suiciding into Tamio. He might have a trick. All right, so let's kill. I don't know. Let's eat one of his guys. Let Tamiya take some damage. Him getting alive isn't all that relevant to me. <clears throat> Tamiya took some damage, but I killed a guy. That's fine. We just want to stop us from taking damage. And we stop Tamiya from taking damage. Ultimately. I need to draw something good. Oh my god, I should just draw another land. This is unreal. Oh my gosh. God, I cannot believe I just drew another land. That is insane. I think I've drawn land like half of my draw steps this game, even though I've been thinning out of my deck. Whatever. We can just draw more land. No big deal. So he's this creature. Yes, I'll pay two life. <laughs> Something's gonna be so much better just to be like a blinding age, blinding major. I don't know, like uh, what's that, what's that card called? Gideon's the Gideon one one creature that taps a creature. What is that thing called? I can't remember. Anyway, you know, I think this would be better as anything. It just taps a creature. You know, there's no there's no option to it. Well, he has a combo with your opponent. I mean, he might have that Viscopa Guild Mitch combo where if your opponent gains life or loses life, you gain that much life, so. I mean, no, no, no. Then I don't know his deck, so. Cabal Coffer is currently just a blank. He just, like, randomly drops Urborg this turn. He doesn't really seem interested in playing his commander. Um, but currently he can exile any creature he wants if he just plays his commander. 
He might be afraid of a counter. Yeah, he's not interested in attacking. Will he just play Homework Path? Okay. He might have double black spells in his hand. Alright, let's get a um, blue black land. Don't think I'm gonna tap land while we're in grave. Get out of our deck. Put, don't draw it. Probably just draw land next turn anyway. <laughs> We've drawn literally almost every land in our deck, which is kind of funny. We're gonna draw three this turn, which is fine. Maybe he has like that black counter spell. Hmm. Nothing all too exciting. Ooh. It's a little better. Hmm. So we can get omniscience and get future sight like instantly. We can do a lot of things here. I mean omniscience isn't the most exciting draw. Which is not the most exciting thing. I'm trying to think of what to do here. Should we play a crystal land? Should we what do we do? Alright, I think first things first. One, two, three, four. Get this card. Gain your life. No. Okay. Let's get underground C. We're going to do this. One, two, do this. I'm not really sure what the best line of play here is. <clears throat> so now we have to hold up Crypto Command. Yeah, we do. All right. I don't really care about his homework path <coughs> at this point, excuse me. Okay, and we'll just sit here. We'll discard two land that we don't really care about. Yeah, so you get two damage. We drew all three of our M um, our ten edition land. Pain lands, as they call them. Johnny Bond drew this one, by the way. Dark Car Waste. Not sure what a dark car is, but it's a cool picture. This game is really long. Yeah. Let's see what happens. Oh, we're playing really slow. I'm sorry. No one's playing faster than us. It's not that usual. Let's see what happens. I guess we could have played Ancient Tomb, we could have Phantasmal Imaged, and we could have held up Crypto Command. But I didn't do that, so my apologies. I don't know what our opponent's going to do. We've gone through 12 more cards than him, though, so you'd think we would be like way ahead, but we're totally not way ahead. Greatborn Muse. Don't really care about that card. All that much. We can always just exile with Mangara. Uh, can we just path it? I don't know what he's going to do. So he finally found a second black, I guess? Or he paid mana with, to make Cobalt All Guys City. He paid more mana with Cobalt Coffers to make the extra black. Right? No. How do you make all that black? No idea. Hmm. Nah, yeah, I'll just path this guy. I don't feel like these guys are all that great. Just path it. <clears throat> okay.
Get that swamp. Well, that's a good card. Alright, so here... We're gonna do this. Okay, so now we can get So when we exile, if we target this, I think with Mangara, um, the target becomes illegal and Mangara doesn't become exiled. So we still get our card. Alright, here we go. So Mangara stays on the battlefield. I get. I'm gonna get Future Sight. You know missions later. Target should become illegal, so I should stay on the battlefield, right? Yeah, nice. No, there would be still land on top. That is so annoying. Um Do we care about Cabal Coffers? Well I'll just tap that. God, I can't believe it's still <laughs> there's still land on top. It's just so insane. Alright, not much you can do about that, so let's pass. I'll pay the two. I could have played um Arcanus, but if he's like some silly wrath that I'm sure you must have because he's playing white black. I don't want to lose. We'll see what happens. <laughs> he copies Homeward Path. He's like a super paranoid. Alright, we need to figure out a way to win. I don't think we're going to win. I think we're going to time out. I'm sorry about that, but... Just, like, haven't drawn anything except land, as you've clearly seen. Land, land, land. Land, land, land. Land, 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 land. Like, look how many land I've played. I don't know. He hasn't drawn that many land, so he's got things. Something to kill me. Okay. Sunblast Angel. It's fine with me. <laughs> so he's a Sunblast Angel. It does fly, so that's something to worry about. He's attacking? With t what? This could be the worst thing ever. I don't know why I did that. Maybe he thought my best card was Future Sight. But it wasn't. Oh, look at Lightning Greaves. Fun card. <laughs> oh, look at Karn. Oh, here we go. Time to drop some Steamroller. Right, you know what? I can just do this. Hold on. Yeah, I can play Karn. I can just do this. I'll pay two life.
And I can keep bouncing this back to my hand. Mm, let's kill your some last angel. Yeah, I'm probably gonna time out. That's fine. So we can just draw like a ton of cards now. It's fun. Draw those cards. All right, I think we're in timeout. <laughs> we played a 50 minute game. What's this card do? No, go away.